But once again, you are watching Battle Arena Melbourne 9 with Juna and the lovely Mim on commentary. Uh, please tweet at us with the hashtag BAM9. Even if you're here in the venue, if you're hearing me talking in the chairs, you can tweet at us. Say, Juna, you're looking nice today. We will show it on stream. Anything. Anything goes, guys. So, man, we're moving into losers now. Mm -hmm. I know you're, you're one for one on your heroes, huh? Bonchan made it. Shan unfortunately fell into losers. But now we have Oil King versus Mago. Do you have any I'm particular... I'm so exciting Rashid play. I really like watching this character. So spinning good. everywhere. Yeah, very mobile, very Are aggressive. Flying all over the place, spinning around. You don't hear a lot about him, too. A lot of people, they're, they're focused on, you know, like Ibuki, Lara, yeah, Not Boxer. a super popular character. Yeah, but he's definitely strong. Very, very solid here. Okay. So the first match of the Losers Top 8, guys. This is uh, different from what we've seen so far. The loser here is going home in seventh place with 100 points. There's no second chance. So Mago getting started here. Going for the jugular right now. Yeah. Already just done. 80 seconds. What happened? <laughs> Sorry, I, I took a, a swig of water and looks like the round is over. I looked back, he was dead. Yes. Yeah. Very clean play from Mago here. Mago playing Karen, uh, kind of like a ground based footsies character. She doesn't have a projectile, uh, but she's very quick with the dash in and the pokes there. Compared to Rashid, who. How do you describe him? Rashid. He's a, he's a nut. Yeah, he's a nut. He's flying, jumping on walls, yes. shooting out tornadoes, spinning around. around. Wearing that costume, yeah. very nice. But both of them very strong on offense, if they can get started here. Nice check on the stand, uh, Fierce right there. Confirms, brings it back to mid-screen, very important. Get out of that corner against Rashid. Rashid corner mix-up is scary. He can cling to the wall, mix you up, go in front or behind. Jumping everywhere off the walls. Putting out that crouch heavy punch, such a good button. You see Karen with V-Trigger. Karen V-Trigger is not as crazy as Ibuki, but you see her spinning with that roundhouse. If she can land one kick, activate uh, into super, that's about 95% damage combo. Super damaging, very scary. Nice. What? The reset. You got a cross up into the eagle strike. That might have been a throw bait, a reset, I don't know what happened. Obviously Mago did not know what happened and he <laughs> ate it. Oil King ties things up 1-1 here. Rashid doing what he does. Yes, carries it to the corner very quickly. Yep. Forgot to mention, but guys, Oil King is the sole Taiwanese representative. Right. Taiwan's last, last stand The last right Taiwanese hope. Uh, Gamer, B in, Gamer B as well from Taiwan here, but could not make top eight as well as Cola. So they're here cheering for their boy Oil King. Good pressure here. No big risk to an Oil King, just content to keep that distance, keep that spacing. A but healthy he, life lead. Yeah. It's very comfortable right now. Yeah, no, no real pressure. Once you have that life lead, there's no real pressure, no need to take risks. But by backing off, he allows Bongo to get started. Okay, Tornado has to block. Rashid's V trigger, that, that Tornado acts as a, a shield, allows him to get in. Take risks, even if he's punished, the tornado has his back. Almost like Nadesco. Jump in. No super. No V reversal, so. Oh, spends the meter, yeah, that's it. Catches the back dash. That move is so fast. Yeah, back dash, any button, any uh, like forward movement, that EX, Eagle Strike, full screen, very, very fast. Mm. Oil King, King with his game so face serious. on. Yeah, he always has oh, yeah. that <laughs> game face on. He's a very nice guy outside of the match, but when he's in the match, he's got that serious game face on. The confident thumbs up every time. Okay, Mago looks like he tried to anti-air with Jab, but instead he had to jump in. Karen does not have the best anti-airs. He needs to be a pro to anti-air, as you see Punk taking out everyone right now with this character. That DP carried him all the way to the corner. Yeah, Rashid she's very strong right with uh, corner carry here. Okay. Mago is fishing for V-Trigger, but instead Oil King is when he lands the V-Trigger. Wake Up EX gets him out of trouble, but still in a very bad position here. One clean roundhouse and a V-Trigger might be able to seal the round, but on the other hand, Oil King just needs any poke. 
Trying to put that round toes out there. Okay. The jumping knee, mid screen okay. cross up. I hear some people clapping behind me. It might be the Taiwanese players, I don't know, but Oil King on the verge of going 2-0. Oh. Right people in the chat getting excited. Reset? No, just Big goes punish. for the damage and the stun. Trying to bring her down here. Lago almost at full life. Oil King under 50. But we've seen him make comebacks before. Once he can get started. Corners himself. He might use the EX Eagle Strike just to get out of there. Create some distance. Get mid-screen. Karen has that very low baby health as well. So it yes. shouldn't be too hard for Oil King to come back right now. He's like a glass cannon, right? Big damage on offense with that super, but low health. Okay. EX projectile pressure. Stay in jab to stop the jump in right there. Point blank unsafe, so Mago activates to make it safe, but Oil King was ready. Oil King seems to be getting most of the jump ins in this Yeah, match a lot so of far. jump ins. Like Karen's like Karen's weakness is definitely anti air, so Oil King recognized that. Jumping in a lot takes it too hard. Chugs, not oil, but chugs the water. The stern look. Watch his confident thumbs up, ready? He does the one pump. The one pump thumbs up. Pushes up Boom. the glasses. The one pump right there. <laughs> Mago looking lost. Looking kind of defeated. Does not have his, uh, his teammates up there cheering him on. Another full jump in. Yeah, you see Punk using, rather than going for an anti-air, he chooses a lot of times to dash under. Yeah. Uh, yeah, rather than using Karen's weak under, uh, anti-airs, dashes under and punishes them on landing. Very successful. Mago's Mago. been eating a lot of those just jump in heavy punches. Yeah, it looks like he's not at that level yet. Will King just chop in the air. Says, look, I got a perfect <laughs> man. You come to me. Will King taking it sleazy right now. He's grinding. He's oily. Just like that. And he's on the verge. He's look at oiled it. Up. He's sliding around. Slippery he's in and out. Slide maybe all the way into finals. Yeah, he'll be good to losers semis, I believe, if he wins here. Okay, goes low, empty jump low. Yeah, very dominating performance, especially that last round. It's getting, each round is getting, you know, further and further away. Oil King's running away with it, very strong. Taking the lead and he might finish it up right now. No shimmy, just goes for a regular grab right there. Mago's ready to tech. Use the projectile to get a little bit of frame advance. Another That's gonna be it. In. Yeah, that jump in, it's man. It's everything. Very dominant. What a dominant play. Congratulations there.